Hello and welcome back to Dentures vs. Food where I try to teach you how to eat with or without your dentures. We are currently at Wendy's. I was out test driving my van after getting brand new springs put on it on the back so now I'm going to stop and grab something to eat. Welcome to Wendy's. May I take your order? Um, give me one second please. Let me know when you're ready. Wow, they have so much. I have no idea what I want. Ooh. That actually looks good. Are you there? Yes, I am. I will take a number four, please. Would you like that large or medium? Medium, please. Thank you. And what would you like to drink? Uh, Dr. Pepper's fine if you have it. Yes, we do. And what else could we get for you? That's it. 1146 of the window. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. So I just ordered the um, classic chicken sandwich, I believe it is, and fries and a Dr. Pepper. I believe it's a classic chicken sandwich. That's what the picture looked like anyway. We're going to find out. So here we are at Wendy's. And then I'm just gonna pull over somewhere and eat because that's how I roll. Uh, which card to use today? I'm thinking this one. <clears throat> oh, that was fast. Well that, oh, that fits under the dashboard. Very cool little chilly I'd really like to roll up my windows right about now <laughs> really like to roll up my window right about now it's a little chilly so I will get back to you in just a few minutes once I get my food okay guys so I have stopped over here at the Walmart parking lot and I got my food and I just Wendy's is right there I just figured I'd pull over right here and yes this is a chicken sandwich so as you can see it's just the chicken sandwich and it's got pickled tomato lettuce mayonnaise on it that's awesome and my fries look pretty old they don't look great yeah they're a little old I hate it when they do that But it's all right. You got to expect stuff like that when you're eating out. You're not always going to get the perfect meal. Especially when you're eating fast food. I hiccup every time I drink a carbonated drink. I very rarely drink carbonated drinks, but when I do, it makes my throat spasm, and I sit there and go <laughs> every time I'm trying to take a drink. Well, yeah, I wanted to show you. Nothing in the bottom denture, except the hair on my finger, cat hair. Nothing in the top denture. So, classic chicken sandwich. That was just a giant bite of chicken. You'll notice while I'm eating this, I'm not using my fingers, my thumb to push on my bottom denture. I'm not smashing it down with my hands or anything else because for me, I've been eating with my dentures for over seven years now. I'm completely comfortable I mostly use my bottom dip bottom lip to push on that bottom denture when I take a bite and 
And of course you want to make sure you bite straight through the sandwich. We're about to get a storm. So far I've had a bite of lettuce, chicken, bread and pickle. I haven't got a bite of that tomato yet. So I told you I was going to randomly be po posting videos. And, uh, or be posting random videos. I never know where I'm going to be. I was making a video testing out the van for one of my other channels because it just had springs put on the back. And I was driving it around to see how the uh, suspension was. And since I already had the cameras all set up, all I had to do was push start. I decided might as well make a video. You can see the sky is really gray. A little bit of sun coming through the cloud. It's been dark and gloomy all day. And as you can see, I'm just in a polo. It's not really cold out here. They're calling for snow. But I have a feeling that the only way it'd be able to snow is if the temperature dropped dramatically throughout the night because otherwise I think we'll just get rain. These fries suck. It tastes like they've been sitting on the counter for two hours. You ever do that? get a burger and fries you go home you eat your burger and some of your fries and a couple hours later your fries are still sitting there and you go oh I forgot I had fries and you grab them and you go uh, now that's what these are like Something I don't talk about much about dentures is because I have to keep my lips so close to my dentures like that to put pressure on my dentures when I'm eating, you have to wipe your mouth off a lot. Because with natural teeth, you don't have to put any pressure on your teeth. You can open your lips up like that and take a bite and your lips can lay down on top of the food like this with dentures your lips have to be real close to your teeth so they kind of smear down the food you got to wipe off your mouth a lot when you're wearing dentures
I mean, unless you don't care. Then you don't have to. That was a pretty big bite. I had something trying to get underneath my bottom denture on this side. Luckily, I was able to push down on it and work it sideways and get it out from under there. Wow. closer I get to the end of this sandwich, the messier it gets. I always try to have plenty of napkins on hand. That figures. I was going to wear my white polo today. And I'm glad I didn't because You'll never notice that stain on this blue one. But if I was wearing a white one. Okay, so over time with your dentures, you will be able to determine if you need to squeeze the food down to match your bite so you're not biting too big. You will learn how big a bites to take, how big a bite you can take without stuffing food in your cheeks and getting it under your dentures. You will learn that you need to have a lot of napkins on hand when you're eating something like fast food. Now, obviously, I'm not using adhesive. But when I was using adhesive, I didn't necessarily have to press my lips against my dentures so hard. Those french fries are garbage. So since I didn't have to pressure my lips against my dentures so hard, obviously didn't need quite as many napkins.
but if you're trying to go adhesive free then you're going to need lots of lot, lot I bit my tongue when I went to swish obviously then you will need lots of napkins sun's going down it's getting dark out here it's getting colder I'm gonna start the van run the heater some more I'm gonna go home I've done my tests in the van I've made two videos today Excuse me. So I'm going to head for the house and I will see you in my next video.